My name is Nicholas Moulton, and I'm the chef at Meze Bistro in Williamstown, Massachusetts. Hi, I'm Derry Rooney from Allium Bar and Restaurant in Great Barrington, Massachusetts. Cooking in my family has always been a part of my life from the time I was born. I just remember wanting to cook my mother dinner, and it was just the two of us home, and I produced her something that came out absolutely terrible, but I thought that it was the best thing because she was nourished and she was eating it. I do have strong early memories helping my mom cater weddings, helping her cook until like two o'clock in the morning. Just the feeling of the nourishment and how happy I felt was something that I produced and that I thought looked and sounded great at the time. I knew from a really early age that I wanted to be a chef and basically have never left the kitchen since. restaurant very heavily focused on supporting our local growers and producers everything is produced within 50 mile radius of the restaurant I hold it close to my heart there's a lot of very intimate things going on with the food at Mezze basically the bottom in restaurants. My experience is varied. I have been a private chef for Meryl Streep. I have been executive chef at two restaurants, one being a French bistro, one being Allium, where I'm at now. I've been a catering chef for Meze Bistro, and I was a chef at Augusta National Golf Club in Georgia. The Berkshires has always been producers and farmers, and while there's definitely new farms, it's always been a prolific area for farming. One of the things that makes the Berkshire so special is we have all four seasons, so it's just ever-changing. Things will not be on the menus unless they're at the peak of their season. Even in March right now, it's so cold and the snow is, is so heavy. Um, we have storage vegetables like squashes and parsnips and carrots and turnips that are still directly from the farm. So to be able to have something that was produced with such high standards right down the road year-round is really special. My favorite thing is to call up my farmers and see what they have and then when it shows up at your door, it's just inspiring in itself because it's pristine. It was probably picked that morning. You just can't get any fresher. I happen to have a fiddlehead fern on one arm and a USDA stamp on another arm that I went with a group of like six chefs and uh, we all got numbers that mean something to us. I have uh, 21 vegetables on my arm, which represent my love for the outside. Um, I have some bacon, which is cool. I have a pig on my arm, which the hair is breed animals from down the road. I've been a mezze for six years and there's just something special about kind of monitoring that animal's life the entire way through. They eat our compost from the restaurant. They go to slaughter for the sole purpose of food. So it's a real intimate thing. chefs and in the past I think I was responsible for one course or for hors d'oeuvres. Whereas this time around, uh, Derry and I collaborated directly and tried to share a story about the Berkshires and, and the food at Meze and Allium. Usually that's the way it goes. We say, you know, who wants to do what, what, what's interesting to you right now and we kind of break it up that way. So it's, it's really a conversation sitting around a table and just being creative. I have a great group of chefs, Derry's one included, you know, we're also tight around the Berkshires and We'll kind of, you know, feed off of each other. But the biggest influence for me is nature and what's going on outside. Mm -hmm.